Hello, this is Greg from SharePoint Maven. And in this video, I would like to show you how you can force Microsoft Office applications to be opened in the native desktop application instead of the web browser. Uh, let me explain to you what I'm talking about. So uh, here I have a document library in SharePoint and a bunch of documents. And by default, when you click on an Office document like Word, Excel, PowerPoint, OneNote, um, they are always open in the browser by default, you see? And the idea is that I can make some changes in the browser. And of course, everything is auto-saved. Uh, and uh, that's pretty much the default behavior. Now, uh, if I want to open it in the desktop in the native application I have installed, um, right, the users have to do this. Essentially, they need to click open and force it uh, essentially uh, open in the uh, native application. But I want this to happen by default, all right? I don't want my users to go in, right click, and do all these clicks. I want them to pretty much click on the file, and I want this file to be opened in the desktop app. So let me show you how to achieve that. Uh, a little bit different uh, to set up on the SharePoint document library compared to OneDrive. So I'll show you both. Uh, first, we'll cover the document library on SharePoint. So here is how to force it to open in the native app. Uh, what you need to do is navigate to the library. All right, uh, gear icon, library settings, advanced settings. And you see over here on the opening documents in the browser, uh, you will see that by default, it will always open in the browser. You can actually force it to open in the native app right here just by clicking this radio button. Click OK. And let's check what happens. So if I click on this uh, budget Excel document now, you see my native application uh, will open up instead of the web uh, browser, all right? Now, how do we make this happen in OneDrive now, all right? Uh, that was the SharePoint document library. How do we make it happen in OneDrive? Again, in OneDrive, same thing. You see, I have an Excel document, could be a Word document, it doesn't really matter. You see, by default, it opens this up in the browser. So I want this all my documents from my OneDrive to be opened uh, in the native app. There are actually two ways for you to uh, to make it happen. Uh, let me show you both. Um, so the first option, they're kind of hidden, so you kind of have to go behind the scenes. So once in your OneDrive, uh, option number one, click on gear icon, OneDrive settings. And sometimes you get this weird data message, just hit refresh. All right, perfect. And then click on more settings and then click on the return to the old site settings page right here. And under site collection features, um, all right, over here, you click on site collection features. All right, and what you need to do here is, uh, let me find that option, I think it was right here, I missed it. Open documents and client applications by default. So you have to activate the feature. So all you need to do is just click that activate button and that's pretty much it. Uh, and it will open up uh, from that point on, the documents will be opened uh, in the native app. Now, I'm not going to hit that button because I want to show you another option. So here's the second option. Uh, the second option, all you need to do is just in the low left-hand corner, click return to classic OneDrive option, all right? And uh, this is essentially uh, the same library, uh, the same OneDrive uh, library, if you will, uh, but shown in classic uh, uh, mode, all right? And what we need to do here is we need to pretty much do what we did with the uh, library in SharePoint. We need to go behind the scenes and alter its settings, uh, gear icon, site contents. Here is the library. Essentially, this is the library where all my personal files reside, all right? And I can click three dots settings over here. Essentially, I'm going behind the scenes. And now it's the same as, you know, instructions are the same as for the uh, SharePoint library, uh, really. So here we go. I'm going to click that radio button, click OK. All right. And let's double check uh, the behavior. So if now I click on this Excel document, you see again, by default, it now opens up uh, in the native app. All right. So that's how you set it up uh, in your OneDrive. Again, you have these two options. Doesn't really matter which one you choose. Now, one other thing I want to mention that 
you know, when you alter those settings, right, when you force the documents to be open uh, using the native app, it only works for the documents that users click on from uh, either OneDrive or SharePoint document library. All right, if I, you know, share this document with someone else, or if I, you know, generate a link, right, uh, to the document and send it to someone, the link that users click on will always open in the browser by default. There is no way to alter that. All the links you share, when you send the links, when you copy links, right, uh, all the links you share um, will always, will always open up in the browser experience by default. All right, so the settings we just altered there only for situations when you open the document uh, right from within a library, all right? Uh, so that's all I wanted to show you today. Hopefully you learned a new trick. As always, happy to see you on my blog, sharepointmaven.com, as well as my YouTube channel. Thank you very much. Have a great rest of the day. Goodbye.